the thing about cancer is you can never be ready for it you never see the reports come and say i was expecting this it's okay until the age of 50 i was getting mammograms done every year the reports always turned out fine i got too comfortable and decided not to do the tests anymore nearly a decade later on 14th august 2020 i felt my chest tighten and went for a checkup and there it was cancer staring back at me in neatly printed text at no other point in my life did i realize the value of time how thinking and acting quickly could actually save my life the first thing i did was to get the tests done at a place recommended by many colleagues in the medical fraternity during the pandemic when most labs were not accepting samples for testing cancer the metropolis team not only accepted my sample but also quickly did a biopsy and reported that i should take a targeted drug therapy if not for this finding i would have to undergo a surgery prematurely my close friends at hinduja hospital got together to help me fight breast cancer my family members and my five best friends came together too and stood by me i was glad for their presence but I knew after a point the battle was going to be an internal one. I had accepted the challenge life had thrown at me and was willing to face it. Cancer threatened me with death, but I chose life. I went through multiple rounds of chemo, lost my strength and my hair. But my faith remained intact. Deep inside I knew I would be okay. that i was chosen for this battle so i would be made stronger along my journey to full recovery i developed a little ritual before drinking water every day it was to utter a prayer for the world to heal standing here today in good health i feel grateful for those countless people who have the same prayer as me and they express it each day in tireless hours of honesty determination and dedication i am navina fazal boy and i chose life